What is going on guys and welcome back to another fishing adventure. So I have been trying to give away this reel for the last 10 days now. I picked two different winners and got no response on the comment. So as you can see right here, Alan was the last winner. I gave him six days to reply and no response, which is weird because Alan usually comments on all my videos, but he hasn't in the past six weeks. Bad time not to be replying, Alan. Sorry, bud, you can no longer win this reel. So instead of picking a random comment, since it failed twice, this time what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hide a hidden message in this video that you're watching right here. And whoever comments the hidden message first will win this reel. So guys, it's not gonna be easy. I mean, you're, you're winning this awesome reel, all right? This is about a hundred dollar reel and you're gonna be winning it for free. So I'm not gonna make this hidden message real big and bold across the screen. It's not gonna be that easy. It's gonna be pretty hard. I think it's gonna be pretty awesome and pretty fun to watch the comments and see who wins and who finds this hidden message. But guys, I hope y'all enjoy the video. Let's go fishing. Check out that catfish. Are you freaking kidding me right now? We're out here on the boat, just having a good day. Not much wind, nice, sunny, beautiful day. We got a little bit of rain last night, so this morning it smelled like rain when I walked out the front door. I love the smell of rain in the morning. I walked out the door and I said, man, it is going to be a amazing day. Hopefully catch a bunch of fish. All right, guys, we got a minnow rod with a double minnow rig. I'm gonna drop these minnows down. Hopefully catch a bunch of walleye and crappie. I do want to go for some bass as well, but that will be later in the day. Right now, I just wanna get a few fish in the boat. Already, already on the minnow, baby. What do we got? Walleye, yeah, buddy. Oh, came off. All right, first fish of the day. Nice little walleye. Not too bad. Thank you, buddy. All right. Oh my gosh, dude. We are on fire right now, boys. Just drop this down, we already have a bite. Back to back fish, baby. Yes. We found a good spot today. Crappie. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, he's kind of small. Sorry, bud. All right, there is two fish back to back. Literally just dropped it down, caught another one. So now we got a walleye on the boat and now a crappie. Drop this back down, see if we can repeat that. Pretty much instant. That was awesome. We're on bottom. I got the rod holder on the boat today. I'll throw a few casts with the Ned rig that you guys saw in the last video, if you've seen it. If you haven't, go check it out. We caught a ton of walleye on the dock. Dude, the bite was back to back. It was insane yesterday. Hopefully today we can repeat the same thing. We did just get two bites back to back, so it's looking pretty good so far. We just got a huge bite, but I was eating. I don't think it's on. Jeez, man, that thing freaking bent the pole down. It turned the rod holder and took our bait. We're getting bites. We're getting bites. That is good. Just drop this back down. And this time, pay attention. Not have our mouth full of a burrito. Already. This spot's killer. Oh, I got off. No. <gasps> Dang it. Still got our bait. That's good. Drop her back down quick. We're not in very deep water. We're in about 13 feet, dude. 
I have a fish on, but I'm gonna let this boat pass me so they don't see me catch this fish. Dude, this spot is absolutely killer. Bites back to back, non-stop, so far. Watch oh, I got a hit right here too. Oh, I got, I lost this one. This is on the Ned rig right here. Okay, that boat has passed. We have a fish on. I don't want no other boat pulling up on me. Oh God, this guy is fighting. Walleye. Walleye, baby. Ow. Why are walleye so sharp? Everything about a walleye is sharp. All right, walleye number two. Two walleye, one crappie. I wanna catch one on an Edric now. Look at that, dude. Back to back, to back, to back, to back, like four times now. Just instant bites. I think I found the best spot at the lake. Dude, this is a killer walleye spot. Holy crap. Dude, that guy's decent. We're gonna keep this guy. We'll keep a few fish today. In the live well she goes. Dang it, and that guy left me a present. A huge mess on my rig here. All right, tangles out. But we got a big old minnow. Check out that fat guy. Big versus small. Let's see what catches the fish first. Actually, it'll probably be the big one because I'm gonna put it on the bottom hook. It's usually the bottom hook that gets bit more. But you never know. They might see that big one and be like, heck no, I don't want that. I'll take a small little snack. All right. So I had no idea there was even fish here. I just saw this rocky point and had to stop. I mean, it's perfect. Why wouldn't there be fish here, you know? Definitely a bunch of rocks to get my Ned rig stuck on. Stuck again. There it is. Oh, yeah, buddy. Let's see what minnow it is. Oh, how'd we get stuck? Is there a tree right there? Bro, we had a fish on. It swam up two feet and then we got stuck on something and the fish got off. No way. I call a scam. That's fraud. Oh, we just got a hit on the net rig just sitting there. They may not like that bigger minnow or something. Dude, I am getting hit back to back on this Ned rig. They're not taking it though. It feels like they're just biting the tail. Oh, they took my big minnow. No. Like I said guys, the bottom minnow is always the one that gets eaten. All right, we're gonna try a way smaller minnow this time. be a crappie oh that's a bass that's a bass <laughs> that guy did not that was weird it was just calmly swam away once I set the hook it freaking took off all right that's a small mouth <laughs> a little guy this guy's freaking feisty dude calm down brother I don't want to be catching bass on live bait but I'll take it. And this guy needs to be way, way bigger. But thank you, buddy. Get out of here. I lost both my minnows. Oh, just one. Never mind. Oh, oh. <laughs> On the Ned rig. Is this the same smallmouth or what? <laughs> it probably is, dude. Oh, no, it's a largemouth. We just got back to back smallmouth and largemouth. Caught the smallmouth on a minnow and then this largey on a Ned rig. It was just sitting here too. That is awesome. A school of bass must have just swam through here. Man, I wish these guys were about three or four pounds bigger, but 
I will take it. We got some bass on the bass boat, baby. <laughs> Thank you, girl. Let's go ahead and drop that back down while we get another minnow. I love just pulling up to a random spot. Not using my fish finders to find fish. Just pulling up to a point or stopping anywhere and then just catching fish. It is so awesome. Doesn't always happen. Well, the closer springtime gets, the easier it's going to get to catch them. There's one on the Ned rig, just bouncing it. It's a fighter. Walleye. That one's long but skinny. We'll throw it back. Yeah, that guy has no meat on it. Thank you, buddy. Yes. Oh, we just got a hit on the Ned rig. It's over here out fishing live minnows. Oh, we're getting a bite. We're getting a bite. Yes. Small guy. Flinging off my minnows for no reason. This guy's freaking pissed. Sorry, bud. Go back home. May try this spot later. Maybe the fish will come back to it. deeper water now too small man they're definitely smaller over here though yeah that guy's nothing ah. is it worth it to stay over here that's just the first one we'll catch another one see if it's small too if it's small we'll leave fishing here is pretty slow though there's a ton of fish on the fish finders but the bite is super slow. Oh, well, speaking of that, there's a bite right here. Bad example, <laughs> but first fish in probably 15 minutes and it got off. I set the hook and it gets off. Sick. Why am I still here, dude? I know a spot where they're biting like crazy. I'm over here fishing in a spot that they're biting every like 20 minutes. Let's get out of here and go back to the first spot. I think I am staying here just because there's so many freaking fish here, but not biting quick enough for me. I'm out of here. Go back to that one spot. Or should we go bass fishing? Yeah, I'm gonna go to the bass spot. The wind has definitely picked up since I left that first spot. Getting a little choppy out here. We're gonna do some bass fishing over here for a little bit. See if there's any bass here. And then we'll probably just call it a day. We caught quite a bit of fish. Had an awesome day. All right, let's see if there's any bass. Yeah, they're not back here. Dude, that first time I came back here, there was like schools just swimming around. But I haven't seen them since that day. All right, we're gonna head back to the docks and call it a day. Pretty freaking wore out, actually. I'm gonna let this guy go. I don't feel like cooking today. All right, thank you, buddy. Still alive and kicking strong. Good to see the live well works. And we're getting the fudge out of here. All right, guys, so that is it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed it. Did you see the hidden message? Let me know in the comments below. Uh, I cannot wait to see all the replies and all the comments just because it's gonna be pretty fun. I kind of want to do more giveaways and stuff like this because it's pretty fun. So leave a lot of likes if you want me to do that. But guys, don't forget to like and subscribe and I will catch y'all in the next one. Peace. Bye.